Hello everybody, Brad Pointer here. I've got the girls in the back of the truck and we're going on a walk today. I uh, filmed some bees as we were walking out the house so you'll probably see that footage here in a minute. There's bees all over our, our little, uh, I don't know what they are, but they grow amongst the clovers and little purple flowers. And we've just got them all over the yard and the bees, the bees were so uh, numerous out there in our little patch that that we decided that our bees are okay. They're doing good. I just I had to film it because they were just the the hum was in the air. Hopefully that came through on the on the video sound. But uh, yeah, we're we're taking a walk. We're going out into nature, and I thought I'd document little pieces of it and uh, see what we're doing. Now, I don't know. I thought that she was just going to jump out of the back of the truck, so I'm glad that didn't happen. But we're going down the hill, and so I will catch up with you guys later. to take a walk and today I wanted to come out here and show you some of the lovely oh hey hello bees see there's a bumblebee oh no it's so cute I know I want to hold there's it there's a bumblebee no, and there's a honeybee <laughs> and we're doing our part here in the pointer yard to make sure that airplanes and bees have a place to eat some grub. Got all of our little flowers, the yellow, big bright yellow flowers, they're gone. But boy, these bees are eating this clover up. And all these little whatever else is they are with the clover. But they are just loving it. Oh, sorry, Bumblebee. I didn't mean to make you mad. But anyway, just wanted to show you guys that. We're our bees. <laughs> Here in Arkansas, I haven't been poisoned to death yet, so we'll see what happens. Keeping really an eye on them. So we're walking up to the railroad bridge where the Underground Railroad didn't do anything because that's not this area. This is the Above Ground Railroad. But that thing over there, that's the round house. I've talked about it in another, or the turnaround, whatever you want to call it. It's a little rotating part of the bridge, which is why the big one in the middle is round. Well, I was stepping on some history. Not real sure what it is. I've climbed down this before. Climbed up it after I fell down it. <laughs> nice. We're down here taking a walk. Look, some crumbling infrastructure. That's kind of disconcerting for those who would be riding on the train. But that's funny. The timbers are lasting as well, or better, than the concrete. Look at that. It's crumbling on the side there. Danger. I don't know. Danger. I don't know how comfortable I'd be taking the train. Danger. Climb it. Okay, no. I'm going to climb it. No climbing the big no, rock. Now see that one up there? The, I was literally just gonna the go one that's pointing out like a finger? Yeah. It's like, that, that one's dangerous. Which well, one? the whole thing it's pretty dangerous. isn't looking exactly like the epitome of, of safe. Look at the, hold on, here's where the real problem is. Look girls. I'm looking. You see that? The part that's half, half, gone, yeah. half gone and then half there? Look over here to the to the 
uh, left of it, I see it, there's a huge crack. And so that means that thing is just holding on. Who knows how many moments away from the crumbling. See, I came here two days in a row, and the first day this was totally fine. The next day after a rainstorm, it was this. <laughs> and I yeah. was like, I'm glad I wasn't here for that situation. Yeah. But the road, we've got some company on the road today. That's fine. Luckily, Cormac McCarthy didn't write this story of the road. So we will all survive. And, you know, me as the or parent. Stephen King. <laughs> you know, yeah, the stand. So, okay. This is, this is a bluff by the side of the road that we are walking down. There was a dog here. <laughs> Uh, now look at this. <laughs> right on a pipeline too. Right here. Yeah, right there on the that on the sewer. <laughs> Looking here. That big old rock. See that I looks like it, that thing's so square. It looks looks like somebody did it on purpose. But if you look up, you can see the trail of destruction leading up here to where it's falling off of there. Now I don't know about you guys. But I don't want to be anywhere near when this stuff starts happening. So hopefully we won't be experiencing any sudden rapid movement of very large stones today. You got the bluffs up here. I'm trying to shade the camera so it doesn't get the, the glare. But look at the 90 degree almost, you know big chunks and then big chunk laying over there so that one actually rolled all the way across the road fun times fun times for sure the girl said their mama would really like these flowers because they're so pretty and purple and I do believe that they are right look at this some beauties Wildflowers out here in the wilds of Arkansas. Right here growing underneath the bluffs and the sound of trickling water from the waterfall that will cause erosion and eventually bring those bluffs down upon our heads. Well that's not peaceful. <laughs> it's such peaceful and relaxing. Where are we still on river? What do you expect? a significant less smelly. That, that, that's not fish, that's dead something. Yeah, it literally smells like a rotted body. I'm going to punch this log. No. No log not. punching. You can't reach it. More rocks. Be careful if you step there because you can tell I slid with my shoe. We got some glare going. It's muddy. <laughs> another bluff here. Oh, glare. Wind flare on oh, Michael Bay. Bay. No. Okay. That's not so we've just got little rocks. Laying all down here, looking like they're fresh. Ha! You know, I ain't scared. It's I'm just scared. one of those. <laughs> it's one of those things where you're like, huh, why are all these coming loose now? Why is this all happening recently? Because it's 2017 and the world is going to shit. Oh. Uh, <laughs> no. <gasps> A booter flew. A big Here, we're looking at a barrel that we can't see. Those There's a barrel down there in the middle of that. Look at these shiny water. leaves. Because human beings suck. Whoa. Here we have the pretty. This is right on the side of the trail here. Little, There's the cave I got stuck in. Little wet weather waterfall that we've got going on. Yeah. Coming down from the top there, down through this little valley. All the way up there. It's even prettier from on top of the cave. To a very pretty field. I'm just saying. Just saying. And it's very nice. I want to like climb to the top of it. I want some water. It's very pretty. <laughs> very beautiful. Dad, well, there was it's a, a pretty little boat. Here, but there's another fallen stone. 
And look at this over here. I mean, it's just, this is just all up and down this little area here. What do we got here? A wooden table. There used to be a wooden table out here. Right no. over there. The, the remains of the, the table. It took a die. I see that. Yeah, I don't know which would be worse. Is that gave loose up above us, up here, and came down? Or if what we're standing on gave loose and shot us down that way? Well, I think I'd be better at sliding than being crushed. So. You think we'd be able to surf it? <laughs> we'd just land up. Water just running out of the rocks. Making molehills out of mountains. It's just a pipe. And in the midst of the beauty, the sewer line strikes its path through the wilderness to join up with this large sewer -y type thing at a junction that goes on that way and continues on on into the distance it's cold on the bottom you think it'd be warm that's weird it's like so hot and it's so cold and so that's it a gravel bar across the river and some houses those people you would think that they were lucky, and they are, until the rains come. Here we go. Look at that. These culverts down here are dumping water into this, this kind of a cut off, cut, slice through of the bank, draining this creek under this road. And that over there is a fishing lodge. And this over here is a tree. And that is a bunch of rocks. Look at it. Thank you for paying attention. And there are flowers. Because they are purple and pretty. Turkey's on the hill. Might way back up in there. Yeah, you guys be careful. Ta-da! I'm careful. Hello, YouTube. Hello. <laughs> oh, I'm not YouTube. <laughs> no, don't do that. I don't want to just that rock, but... Yeah. Here we have Hearst Caves down here in this little area. Got the water dripping everywhere. This, these caves have been used by people since before they were white people in America. Oh. somebody down at the at the boat docking us back here I'd say probably a good fifth of the population of Cotter was conceived in here <laughs> shine your light over that way big pop-up that's me Let's see my light doesn't even reach in there Scarily.
discussing. Yeah. Oh, it's always been like this. What? Oh, okay. I thought you saw something. I don't blame you. So I'm in the cave with my dad and my sister. And this is Hearst Caves because that used to be Hearst Fishing Service. But as you can see, before the spray paint was readily available, if you look closely, Behind a lot of these, you can see Cards. people's initials and all kinds of things Cards. carved in and out. It just kind of like flakes off when you yeah. touch it. That's good yeah, this is definitely not a not the place where you want to live in, but it's a cool place to visit. Limestone caves can be dangerous as all get out. And that's really what we have a lot of here in Arkansas, in the Ozarks especially. I'm just going to go down this way. Yeah. Oh, it looks like a Jindler Bluff uh, slope, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that's why I said I'm going to take you down this way. Even though you might get water dripping on you, it seems like Okay, be careful touching that stuff. I know. I'm not like holding on to it. I'm just Okay. Willow. <laughs> Willow got out of bed this morning and knocked on the door. And she's like, come here, come here, come here. So I went outside and I said, okay, what? Thinking that there was some drastic thing that she needed me to look at or some problem that needed solved or something. And she's like, I want to do something today. And so I was like, huh. And then I surprised her by actually doing something today, which is our walk. She's not ready to actually do things. <laughs> she, she was like, oh, um, okay. And so now she is on this walk in pseudo pajamas in something that she would normally perhaps sleep in, at least parts of it. Every, I sleep in all of these things, except for your shoes. And so, so <laughs> now. She's just so tired, just sleep in shoes. So, I've done that before now. But she was so startled, and that I said yes, that she wasn't prepared. Well, now I'm going to do a jump in a river because I'm so unprepared that I'm sweating. <laughs> uh, well, guys, I think that we're headed back now. We, we saw the cave. We've seen the bluffs. We, say, we came, we saw, we sweat. We, we got sweaty. And there's still a long way to go, so if something pops up, we'll, we'll pop back in. But, just in case, thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, then like it. And I'll catch y'all on the spatula side. Peace. <laughs>